Oh, wow. Why are you so sweaty and out of breath? <laughs> Is something wrong with you? Ow, I hit my elbow. <laughs> okay, you gotta stay still. I don't know what's going on with you right now. You found something amazing. Why do I feel like we have this conversation every single week? Oh gosh. Do you hear that rumbling? Oh, that means the neighbors are vacuuming upstairs. Oh well, tell me, because I know you're impatient. Mm hmm. Wow, your boss is pretty nice. He canceled a four hour meeting. Okay, so he didn't cancel. He relocated a meeting to a pumpkin farm. <laughs> I can't imagine all you um, suit and tie and pencil skirt office people at a pumpkin farm. <laughs> what did you guys do? Take lettuce and feed the sheep? Uh, it was a mental health thing, I see. No, I'm not complaining if you had to go somewhere instead of a meeting during work hours for free. Go for it. Nothing wrong with that, right? Uh, you did some pumpkin carving? So where's your pumpkin? <laughs> That's something I would do. Right after like my shift is over, I'd be like, I don't want this damn pumpkin and throw it out. But, you know, we could have made pumpkin soup. And you know I love pumpkin soup with some corn. You should have brought some corn. They didn't have. Hmm. I find that very, very suspicious. Hmm. No, I know you. You didn't explore the whole thing. You probably said, I'm here to do whatever nonsense you want me to do. And then you just freaking did it. There probably was corn all the way in the back of the farm, but... Yeehaw. You didn't want to go get it. You're very, very, what's the word? Selfish, thoughtless, ungrateful piece of. <laughs> All right, get to the point now. Ah, so they brought you some drinks, okay. Mimosas, mm hmm. And you had the most amazing donuts. Oh, ew. Okay. I think I know where you're going with this. But yes, those apple cider donuts from Dunkin' literally tasted like um, apple cider vinegar. <laughs> it wasn't that great. And had a filling. Oh, wow. So those donuts were 10 times better, I'm guessing. Mmm. Oh, you know, I love caramel. Caramel. No one says that. It's caramel, sweetie. <laughs> oh, wow. Ooh. You stole five donuts? <laughs> and who do you think is going to eat it? You're going to eat four of them? Oh, one for me. How sweet. So what are these? Is this coated with, like, sugar and cinnamon? You're not sure because it tastes like apple? Hmm. So maybe it's a spice blend? I don't know. It's true, you're right? It doesn't taste like cinnamon. It tastes like apple sprinkles or something. I don't know what they did. But sugar, it's white sugar granulated. Oh, that's unusual. Okay. So I have to rip the center open. Okay. Mm, oh, wow. You know, honestly, I'm not a filling type of girl. Meaning, like, if something has, like, something inside it, I tend to stay away from it because I remember whenever my dad would take us to Dunkin' Donuts, I once said, I want the Boston, the Boston cream donut. Something like that, whatever it's called. And then it had, like, Eckler inside, like, the white cream. And I said, oh my god, it was overload. I just never liked it. Because my mom made something called, like, it's called atolito. 
I don't know how it is, but it's like a creamy thing. It tastes exactly like that. And I was like, ugh, I don't like creamy stuff. Well, <laughs> except one thing, but we're not going to talk about that. Okay, babe. <laughs> but yeah. Um, so whenever something has like a filling inside, I just tend to stay away from it. So I'm going to trust you on this and we'll see how it tastes. Gotta lick the donut first. <laughs> Because I'm a psycho, that's why. Only psychos like donuts. Remember that scandal with Ariana Grande when she was licking donuts? <laughs> okay, let me do it too. Mmm, granulated sugar. <laughs> okay, let me bite. Oh, wow. That's really, really good. <laughs> It kind of gives me like a pumpkin pie kind of filling, except it's apple, so apple pie filling. Oh my god, I love apple pie. Mm, this is good though. It's heavy, but it's good. You're right. Maybe I'll trust your taste buds these days. Besides, I like to eat this, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. My lovely cave. <laughs> So, I think you know what tastes good and what doesn't. Oh, I have a really crazy- oh my god, I have an amazing idea. Okay. Why don't we carve- and by the way, why do these donuts don't have holes on them? That is so weird. Anyways, why don't we carve a hole in the donut because it should have a hole in the center. And then why don't we put it right here <laughs> in the place of the forbidden nectar. I'll hold it. And then you're going to put your tongue and you're going to lick the donut and you're going to lick my cave at the same time. So it's like it's sweet and savory and just gushing out with yummy, yummy. A substance, protein, sugar, and then your mouth will be like sticky from the sugar, but also it will be sticky from everything that I feel. It will be like dessert on crack or dessert part two or dessert two X. You know those some young noodles that have like two X spice. That's exactly what this is. We're going into spicy town. Come on. I know you wanna. Please. <laughs> or how should I say this? Let's do it as a way of me saying thank you for bringing these donuts. Now let's make them extra, extra special. Should I heat it up? Do you want me to run a hot bath? Well, you need a shower first, but I can run a hot bath and we can both go. And I'll warm this up. Besides, I like my dessert warm sometimes. And this feels like it should be warm and fuzzy. Besides, I'm feeling cold down there. And I just want a nice, hot, wet, warm tongue. <laughs> I think we should go run the bath. I'm gonna join you, okay? And then we're gonna have fun.